What are you doing tonight, Luke? So, we've got some press. So I've got uh, three sets, five reps of 150. Then I'm doing some incline dumbbell press, incline dumbbell rows, face pulls, and a lot of other sexy stuff just to finish off. So, just waiting on Tom. He just told us he's not training until seven. Thanks, Tom. I've all hyped up in pre-workout. So I'm just going to get into it, wait for Tom. Hopefully he'll turn up at seven. So it's the time now, it's like, Six. Um, so he's got about half an hour, so hopefully he'll get here. I'm not sure what he's doing. Feeling quite good today, actually. Had a nice day at work. It's a busy day. Oh, a lot of people asking, do you still work in the rigs or? Um, so I'm not actually working the rigs at the moment. I've just started a new contract onshore, which is brilliant because it's only 20 minutes away from the house. Working there six days a week, which is probably the best contract I've had because it enables me to cook all my meals. Take them into work, I get to see Cushy, see my little Cush Cush at night, give her a wee bit of cuddles. <laughs> being offshore in the rigs isn't the best, but I mean that's what I've done and it's been alright, so hopefully this this will keep us going up until Britain's. And also, just got paid from Dubai, so I'm going to go out and buy a wee Lamborghini tomorrow. Thanks Don and Mark for that. I'll be cruising with Tommy. Tom will be in his, uh, what will Tom buy? A mini. A wee mini, aye. A picanto. A picanto. <laughs> he fitted in that well the other day. Yeah. That was good. Yeah, so we're going to start getting warmed up. I've just been for a Sunday as well. You look like Cushy now, but you're turned. What burnt? <laughs> hey, Frank. socks out today so sometimes when I when I press with normal socks I feel my feet slipping a little bit in my shoes I've noticed that the last couple of times so you can see these bad boys oh look at them what's that is that like rubber yeah so it's just grip it just grips I saw Bush Adam Bishop he had a pair yeah so these socks here they're very nice it's on uh, B O T T H M S bot thins bot thins so thank you for sending them up to me. I'll uh, see how they go. So hopefully these will not be staying in one place. If not, then I'll send them back to you, dirty. You should have had an odd pair like Tom. That'd you be strong. No, I don't want to copy Tom. Because if I copy him, then he'll slap me off with, Ugh, stop copying me. That's my thing. Stop doing jobbies. What happened there, bro? I just tried to go too fast. I tried to made a 20 kilo increase and tried to go fast like that's not a good idea. That's a wee learning point for everyone. How not to do reps and fall over and make yourself look like an idiot. But we're only human and we all make mistakes. Even me. But hopefully the next reps, the next sets will be better. I hope. Still no sign of Tom. He's probably doing a jobby. He's probably doing a jobby. I've just been a spicy boy in general. While doing a jobby. He's just phoned. 
he's on his way here apparently, he's like, oh, yeah, in the gym, are you at home, which is not in the gym, like I said. Oh, I was just going to see if you'd make me a shake. I say, oh, I'm in the gym. Hope you get your shake, Tom. And don't come in too grumpy. Anyway, last set in the walk. What way is that Luke? 50 kilos for 8 reps um, So doing 3 sets of 8 reps So I'm still going to use 50 as like a warm up Not a class, it's my first working set So the 50s, maybe 60s We've got 70 kilo dumbbells but I think it's a bit early in the in the day to be doing them And it's just like an accessory Dumbbells is an accessory to kind of my overhead press that I use So you don't see many strong men really do like flat bench a lot of time it can bust up your, your rotator cuff and there's a lot of risk when you do heavy bench so I like to do like a lot of dumbbell work um, that's something that Sebastian has kind of incorporated into my training program more dumbbell stuff I think that's really crossed over into my lock press it's feeling I mean those 150s felt like nothing really you know when we were doing it which is um, it's probably the best 150 I've, I've felt in only I don't know week two into the training so that's kind of a nice feeling obviously Still a long way to go. I will see. Yeah, buddy. Is that Tommy? Where have you been, Tom? <laughs> I've been in Peter Vara, refing Valhalla Strongest Man with Rob Frampton. How'd he go? Great. They all did good. There was a big turnout for so late in the year. I think there was like 40 plus competitors, and it was a really competitive open class. So yeah, it was good. Good fun. It was cold, but I'm tired and I'm moody because I'm back up here. So you won't be training tonight, no? No, I'm just going to watch old man train. Oh, yeah. I'll be back training on Monday. Check me out, check my flow. It's the resistible. Don't give a fuck because I still got the bills. Huh? <laughs> Wagwan. Wagwan, my brother. How was that? <clears throat> yeah, it was okay. Just I've got a bit of just a lot of tendon pain, so I when I pull the bicep, I pull the dumbbell up, sorry. My bicep nips a wee bit, so that's why big T gave me a little hand. I think Tom's weighing himself. How much do you think he weighs? One, six, seven. Tom, how much do you weigh? One fifty one. Have you gone down? Twenty kilos. Yeah, no. I was 160 last week and then we're down to 150. You're not 150. I am 154, Simon. I've been tracking out with Simon. That's why I've been like, can't be bored doing anything. Cut. <laughs> no, you better. Oh. So, we're going to do some face pulls, rope pulls, whatever you want to call them. So the thinking is, I'm not going to pretend I made this up because I got told. But obviously we're doing pressing today, which kind of makes you kind of hunched in more. Like we're told by a, a very successful strongman to do some kind of rowing motion or face pulls just to open up your chest 
So obviously when we're, when we're pressing, again like I say, we're kind of closing it, but we want to open it back up to give us that kind of wide shoulder kind of base. So I'm going to do some bolt pulls. That's a little bit of science for you. Bro science, if you will. So isn't that right, Tom? Would you agree with that? I still think it's a bit deadlift. Makes sense. So I do rope pulls also to give me a big deadlift. <sighs> so you get a big deadlift. <sighs> well, that's my training session done. Poor Tom is not feeling so well. As he said, he's a little bit tired from the travelling, so it's okay, big guy, you just have a nice wee sleep. So Tom's having a lot of sleep on the mirror fit mats. Not only good crash mats, but turns out they're a good bed. Orthopedic, it might seem. So guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry about Tom's lack of enthusiasm. What did Tom say? If you like the video, swipe to Norway. No, swipe up. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. And please guys, ring that bell. Ding, 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 ding.